Okay, we got it this time. The T-Rex. We got a mini T-Rex. I'm happy about it. Hi guys, I'm Dan and welcome to a brand new video and today we are going to catch some amazing dinosaurs today. We have 40 super super cool dinosaurs in this claw machine and we have about 20 coins to catch as many dinosaurs as possible. Okay, so let's get started. But before I start, just want to say a huge thank you to you guys for your amazing support. All you dinosaurs are just amazing. So let's get started, okay? So I'm gonna put the first coin into the machine right here. And we are going to catch our very first dinosaur. So I'm gonna move the claw. And uh, we're gonna try to aim for this one right here. So let's go and get it. Okay, it's not working. So I'm going down. Oops. Oh. Let's try again. We don't have much time. Oh yes, we managed to get one. I mean two. Looks like we have got the Triceratops and Pteranodon at the same time. Wow, that is awesome. The Triceratops is actually stuck here. So let's have a look at what we have got now. So the first one over here is a Triceratops. Okay, and this is from Kyoto, I suppose. A really cool Triceratops. The Triceratops is also known as the Three Horn Phase. Okay, so this is a really cool herbivorous dinosaur. Okay, so let's put this aside and let's have a look at this Pteranodon that we have just got. This is a superb looking Pteranodon. Take a look at this. The wings are actually translucent, and this is from Collecte. Pteranodon is a prehistoric flying reptile, okay, and this is a really cool, really cool figurine, okay. So, let's move on and catch our second, actually the third dinosaur, okay. We got super lucky with the first coin, we actually managed to get two dinosaurs with only one coin. So, let's get the next one. Let's move the claw. I'm gonna try for this. The Spinosaurus over here. Wow, looks like we have got another two dinosaurs. So this, we have got really lucky, okay? I'm gonna try to put them down right now. Alright. Oops, we actually just got one. The Spinosaurus at the back just got stuck right over there. And what do we have here? This one is definitely a Diplodocus. Diplodocus is a herbivorous dinosaur, and this one looks really, really cool. And this is from Collecte. Diplodocus is a herbivorous dinosaur. You can check this really long neck, which allows this dinosaur to fit on leaves from really really tall trees okay I love the stripes on this really cool really cool dinosaur I'm gonna place this right over here on top of the waterfall okay so let's move on and try to catch our fourth dinosaur but actually we have already got the fourth dinosaur over here okay so we are gonna get our fourth and the fifth dinosaur I'm gonna drop, try to drop this one down first. Okay, it's actually stuck here. So I'm gonna try my best to get this fella up. Oops. Oh, I actually triggered the machine. And I thought that we have actually got a new dinosaur, but that's fine, okay? So what do we have here? We have a JW, which means Jurassic World Spinosaurus, and this one looks really cool. I love the gold paint on the 
silverish body. Okay, the Spinosaurus is a carnivorous dinosaur, and this one looks really, really awesome. Check those muscles out. Okay, so this Spinosaurus is from Jurassic World Hasbro Mini Blyback. Okay, so I'm gonna go with the fifth one right now. I'm gonna move the claw machine, the claw right here, I'm gonna move it upwards first. Maybe we can try to get those at the back, okay. I see one st Stegosaurus at the back, or probably two. Let's try to get them. No luck! No luck this time. We don't have much time, we have to hurry! Not really good this time. Oh dear. Alright, we have got this one over here and we have to hurry, don't have much time. Alright, we got it. And what do we have here? And this one is a really, really cool purple Giganotosaurus. Okay, and this one looks really awesome. It's actually like a puzzle toy. You can actually assemble them yourself, which is really, really awesome. Let's have a really close look at this awesome dinosaur from Kyoto. And this one looks super, super nice, okay? It's a Popo Giganotosaurus, okay? Giganotosaurus is a carnivorous dinosaur, okay? I'm gonna try to place this right over here, just behind the Diplodocus. Awesome, okay? So let's move on and try to catch our six dinosaur game. Okay. So here's the coin. I'm gonna put it right into the machine right now. So here we go. I'm gonna try to get one of this really cool looking dinosaur over here. The green one over here looks really, really nice. All right, what? I didn't get that. We don't have much time, so we have to hurry. Let's try again. Okay, we got this. Looks like it's a Kandrosaurus, okay? We have to hurry. Don't have much time. Gonna drop it right now. Alright, we managed to get this okay this really really cool Kandrosaurus is actually a 3d puzzle toy so this toy actually comes in different parts and you have to assemble them yourself which is really really fun I feel yeah so a Kandrosaurus is definitely a herbivorous dinosaur and take a look at those two spikes at the side of the body so these two spikes actually helps to differentiate it from on the Stegosaurus pretty easily and of course the Stegosaurus do not have spikes like this at the back of the tail so this Kandrosaurus is looking really really nice okay, which one is your favorite herbivorous dinosaur okay let me know in the comments I think a lot of people will actually go for like Triceratops maybe Brachiosaurus or Stegosaurus what is your favorite herbivorous dinosaur let me know in the comment section below, okay? So let's get on with the Severn Dinosaur. Okay. Let's go and get the huge one at the back, okay? Gonna move the claw up first and backwards. And I'm going down now. Looks like we got a small one over here. And this one looks like a T-Rex. Drop it right now. Great job, okay. And we got ourselves a really, really nice fatted T-Rex. And this is from Collecte, okay. Tyrannosaurus Rex is a 2015 model from Collecte. You know, a Tyrannosaurus Rex is also known as the Tyrant Lizard King. 
It's actually a carnivorous dinosaur. It's actually one of the fiercest and the most popular dinosaur ever. Okay, it's the T. Rex your favorite dinosaur. It's definitely my favorite dinosaur. If you take a look at this T-Rex, you can see some really nice feathers. So, you know, scientists actually believe that a T-Rex was covered with feathers, okay? So what do you guys think? Do you like a dinosaur with feathers or a dinosaur without feathers? Let me know in the comments, okay? So let's move on and try to get our 8th dinosaur. 2, 4, 6, 7, 2, 4, Actually, the ape dinosaur. That is correct. Okay, let's try to get our ape dinosaur. I'm gonna try to get this Pachycephalosaurus right over here. No luck. Let's try again. We got it. Great job. <laughs> so we have got the Pachycephalosaurus and um, let's have a look. Pachycephalosaurus is actually a herbivorous dinosaur and take a look at this, the head of the Pachycephalosaurus. This skull right over here is really tough again. Pro it probably used the head to, you know, for um, protection for self-defense and probably to challenge against other Pachycephalos Pachycephalosaurus for territory or even for mates, okay? So this one is looking really awesome. It's a model from Collecte. I love the details on this really nice figure. Okay, I'm gonna place this right over here and we are going to catch our knife dinosaur. We have some really really cool dinosaur over here and I want to get this Mosasaurus over here. It's really awesome. Let's try to get one really cool dinosaur. Wow, we have got a flying dinosaur. Is this like a Pteranodon? It doesn't look like one. It looks more like a Dimorphodon. And it's stuck right here. Oh my goodness. Okay, we actually managed to get it out pretty easily. And what do we have here? A JW Dimorphodon, okay? And this is from Hasbro. So a Dimorphodon, Dimorphodon was actually, um, you know, it was actually from Jurassic World the movie. So that was a really, really cool movie. And I can't wait to watch the second Jurassic World movie, okay? So Dimorphodon is a carnivorous dinosaur, rather prehistoric flying reptile. And yeah, this is really cool. I love this a lot. The paint looks really nice, but it's actually totally different from what you see in the movie. So we are going to catch our number 10 dinosaur. Okay, so which dinosaur should we get? I want to get that Stegosaurus right in the back green one over there so I'm gonna try okay I'm gonna move it backwards and yes I'm gonna try to move it to the right and down we go to get this it's not good it's very difficult to reach those at the back okay I'm gonna try to open the claws right now. Seems like we have a chance. No. Oh dear, this is not very good. This is not looking good. Just gonna try to get any dinosaur we can possibly get. Oh dear, we are running out of time. No good. Oh dear. This is bad. Too slow. <laughs> okay, so we have to try again. Looks like we have a ready catch. Oops. Oh, the machine didn't work this time. Okay, what do we have here? I think this is a Cantrosaurus. 
Hopefully we can get a second one. Oh dear, we didn't get we didn't have a chance to get a second one. So we have a Kentrosaurus right over here. It's from Collecte. I don't want to waste too much time. I want to get the Stegosaurus right at the back. So let's go. Kentrosaurus is really huge. You know. Stegosaurus, I mean. So I think everybody is going to go for that one. Let's try to get it. Oh dear. No luck. We might have a chance this time. Still not good. Yes, we have got it finally. A really huge can Stegosaurus and hopefully we can manage to get this later big fella up. Keep dropping it right now. Great job, okay. Let's have a look at this Stegosaurus from Jurassic World. This is a really cool Stegosaurus. Okay, it's one of the largest dinosaurs in this claw machine, and I must say I like this a lot. Take a look at those two rows of blades on top, or rather plates, and four spikes at the end of the tail. So this one is looking really, really awesome, okay. Stegosaurus is a herbivorous dinosaur, so this is really really awesome. I'm gonna put this right over here, top of the waterfall. So we have already got like, like 10 dinosaurs, so we are going to get our number 11 dinosaur from the machine, okay? So here's the coin, I'm gonna put it right in. And let's go! Okay, looks like we have some really cool dinosaurs over here. I'm just gonna try my luck. Any dinosaur will do for me. <coughs> Oops. And it looks like we have got an Iguanodon, okay? And this Iguanodon is looking really, really nice. <coughs> I beg your pardon. I'm having a like bad throat, okay? So this is an Iguanodon. So basically, this is like a 3D puzzle. It's looking really nice, okay? So basically, this toy comes in different small parts, like how many pieces are there? Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's about seven parts, so this one is really awesome. <coughs> so an Iguanodon is actually a herbivorous dinosaur. Okay, and this one looks really, really cute. It's not as detailed as compared to some of the dinosaurs which you guys have seen just now, but this one is still a pretty cool dinosaur okay so i'm gonna place this right over here looks like we have a lot of dinosaurs and some of them are actually lying down okay <coughs> so looks like we have some dinosaurs stuck to the claw and that is awesome because we can just basically just get them out pretty easily okay so let's go and try to get them out from the machine. Just need to move them to the left and try to drop them down now. So we have a Carnotaurus over here and this one looks really cool. The Carnotaurus is a carnivorous dinosaur, okay? So this one is looking really, really awesome. I'm gonna place this right over here. Okay, and let's move on with the next one. Looks like we have a Therizinosaurus stuck right there. So I'm gonna try my best to get this fella out from the machine, okay? 
Whoops, looks like it's stuck right there. Okay, I'm gonna try my best to push it. Wow, looks like... What? Oh my goodness, we actually managed to get just a claw or an arm from the Therizinosaurus model and that is really funny, okay? I'm gonna try to rescue you. Okay, but we have to insert another coin. We can probably get this guy up later on. I'm gonna try to get some other dinosaurs. Okay. Let's try with this one right here. No luck. Oh, oh dear. It's not looking good. We have got the Mosasaurus, but hopefully it doesn't get stuck right here. Oh dear. Bad luck this time, okay? So I think we have to try to get this fairy Xenosaurus up before we can actually reach other dinosaurs here. So I'm gonna try my best to get this fella up first. Oh dear. Okay, looks like we have got the Triceratops. Okay, we have finally got this Therizinosaurus up from the machine. And it's actually a parcel toy as well. As you can see, it comes in like different parts. Yeah, so I'm gonna place this right in. So we have a beautiful there is an Osaurus, and um, yeah, and this one should be from Kyoto or Firuta. I, I suppose this is from um, Kyoto. Okay, a there is an Osaurus is a herbivorous dinosaur, but with those claws, you know, many people would, you know, possibly mistaken a there is an Osaurus for a carnivorous dinosaur, which I did in, you know, in the past. Okay, but this is a herbivorous dinosaur, which is a really cool one. So we don't have many coins left, probably about like um, 6 or 7 coins. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try my best to catch as many dinosaurs as possible. So let's go! Shall we get this huge Triceratops over here? Maybe we should, okay. Got it this time pretty easily. And what do we have here? We have a Triceratops, and this Triceratops looks really awesome. And this one is from. I can't really remember. I think this is from. Oh, yes, this is from JW Jurassic World Hasbro Blindback. Okay. So a Triceratops is actually a herbivorous dinosaur, but it's actually a really huge herbivorous dinosaur, which proved to be. A formidable opponent for the T-Rex. Okay, so it's believed that you know the T-Rex and Triceratops they had like battles in the past, and Triceratops I feel could possibly you know like defend itself very well against the T-Rex. Cost is actually a really really huge and tough dinosaur, and with those you know three horns right in front, you know this Triceratops. Tops is definitely able to defend itself very well against the Tyrant Lizard King. So let's move on with, you know, we have a couple of coins left, so let's not waste. Oh dear. It actually took one of my coins. Okay, so I'm gonna move in. Looks like we have another Triceratops over here, so I'm gonna try my best to get it.
through here. Not very good. Let's go, let's go. We don't have much time. Oh my god. It's not looking very good. Okay, we don't have much time. We have to hurry up. Oh my god. Okay, we have got the Stegosaurus, but we have to hurry up. We don't have much time. Dropping it right now. Oh dear! Wow, that was really close in. Too bad we didn't manage to get it. Okay, so I'm gonna try right now. Move it backwards. Let's try to get this fella out. This one, sh this time it should be easy, okay? Dropping this Stegosaurus right now. So we have got this one from Collecte, and this is a really cool Stegosaurus, okay? I love this one a lot, okay? I'm gonna place this right over here so that you guys can see it. So we are left with only four coins, so we are gonna try our best to get as many dinosaurs as possible. Hopefully we can get four or five. Like this. Wow, this is tough, okay. Pretty tough. Oh dear. Okay, we got it this time. The T-Rex. Got a mini T Rex. I'm happy about it. So we have a 3D puzzle mini T Rex. Okay, so this T Rex comes in many, many small parts. And um, take a look at those two fingers from the T Rex. It's actually pretty well made for a very, very small dino. So let's move on with the next one. Let's go for those at the back hopefully we can get a good one okay oh dear no <laughs> good bad luck Get it, get it! Great job! And what do we have here? This is a Brachiosaurus and this one is also a 3D puzzle. Okay, and this one looks really nice. You can actually assemble it yourself, which is pretty fun. So we are left with only two coins. To just two coins and let's try our best to get two more dinos, okay? I see a beautiful Triceratops right over here. I'm gonna try my best to get it. Oh dear, stuck right there. Oh dear, looks like we are running out of time. Okay. We got a mini dino over here. I'm not too sure what dinosaur this is. And it looks like we have a Velociraptor. So we have a Velociraptor over here and I'm pretty happy about it. This Velociraptor looks pretty cool. Take a look at those two sickle claws. This one is also a mini 3D puzzle, which is really, really nice. I'm gonna place this right over here, okay? So we are left with the last coin and let's see what dinosaur we can get. There's actually a very very nice Mosasaurus over here, but I don't think we can get it because it's actually right in the corner. So it's gonna be pretty hard to get the fella out. But let's just try our best, okay? Let's move the claw down. 
looks like we might have a chance. Yes, we got it. Yes, we have got the Mosasaurus. Oh dear. Come on, we don't have much time for the last. Oh dear. Oh my god, we actually got the Triceratops instead. So we didn't manage to get the huge Mosasaurus out from the claw machine, but we got a very tiny Triceratops and this is from Collecte as well. As you know, Triceratops is a herbivorous dinosaur which we have already gotten just now. So we have a couple of Triceratops and um, yeah, that's all for today. We actually got pretty, pretty, pretty cool set of dinos. You know, we have like Brachiosaurus, T-Rex, we have Velociraptors, we have um, Dimorphodon, we have like a feathered T-Rex, Kentrosaurus, Stegosaurus, we have like Spinosaurus, Pteranodon. This one is actually one of my favorite. And um, we have like a Therizinosaurus, Giganotosaurus, Diplodocus, um, another Stegosaurus, a Carnotaurus, and an Iguanodon, and a Pachycephalosaurus, and another 3D Kentrosaurus. So that's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you do, give it a thumbs up and you know share it and leave me a comment. You know I read every single one of them. And I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Goodbye.